Today on the Stay at Home Chef, I'm showing you how to make spicy Szechuan shrimp and broccoli. This classic American Chinese takeout favorite is super easy to make at home. We're going to start by making a sauce. It starts with about a quarter cup of water, then add in one and a half tablespoons of soy sauce, one and a half tablespoons of Asian chili garlic sauce, then we'll add in a tablespoon of freshly minced ginger. If you don't have fresh ginger, you can also substitute half a teaspoon of dry ground ginger. Next, we'll add in two to three cloves of crushed garlic, half a teaspoon of red pepper flakes, and about a teaspoon of honey. You can also use a teaspoon of granulated sugar in place of the honey. We want our sauce to thicken up as it cooks, so next we're gonna add in two teaspoons of cornstarch. And that's it for our sauce, so we'll go ahead and whisk this all together. Set that aside and we're gonna head on over to the stove and get things cooking. You'll need a wok or a large skillet heating over high heat. Pour in a tablespoon of cooking oil. And then we're gonna add in two cups of frozen broccoli that has been thawed, and then a pound of raw jumbo shrimp that has been peeled and deveined. Then pour your sauce right over the top. Then just toss this together and let it cook until the shrimp turns pink. Shrimp is done as soon as it is no longer translucent and it turns pink and you can see on the tails the most pink there. As soon as that happens, I'm gonna turn off the heat and add in about a quarter cup of sliced green onions and just give this one last quick toss. And that's it, we're ready to eat. You can serve this up hot over some cooked rice or just eat it plain. Now I like to leave my tails on when cooking shrimp because it's so much prettier that way, but you can make it easy on yourself for easy eating by cutting off the tails before you cook the shrimp. Thanks for watching. As always, you can find the full written recipe in the video description. Be sure to subscribe and check out the rest of my channel where you can find hundreds of restaurant quality recipes you can easily make at home. See you later.